2013 boat show sitting in a Muskoka chair. Good friend Jay, Mastercraft Boats. It's been a year. How you been doing? I've been doing great. Uh, we're glad to be back. We got the Muskoka chairs here. We've got a new Muskoka store as well as our store in Buckeye this year uh, in Bob Cajun. So we're excited to be here. We got all sorts of new boats. New boats? New boats. Let's go check out new boats. Awesome. Excited. All right. Okay, Jay, we're walking up to the X-55. So yeah, this is a not a new boat for our line, um, but it's the first time we've ever had it here at the boat show. This is the big dog. It's a 25 foot long boat, yep. um, deep. It's got all the cre creature comforts you would ever imagine in a wakeboard boat. So uh, we got a nice teak deck step. There's a teak walkover. Yeah. Uh, just so you keep your shoes off the off the walkover. There's a cool little fold down step here. Yeah, saving on two cup holders. Yeah. Um, nice big room. You can you know have all your friends aboard. Uh, this one has the optional reversible seating. So um, every X55 comes with this forward facing seat. Yeah. But then it also um, this seat reverses, so you can still have that traditional ski boat style seating. Yeah. Um, Another nice thing about this boat, it's the only wakeboard boat, uh, inboard wakeboard boat, it's got an onboard head there. Oh my so, god. So, you know, you're out, um, bigger water, Georgian Bay, um, if you're out for the day, you got your onboard head there, uh, there's a little sink in there, lets you, you know, you don't have to go back to shore for anything anymore. Yeah. This one is a really popular option with uh, some of the moms out there. Jay, you took me by surprise on that one. I was Absolutely. not expecting that. Well, the other nice thing too is, I mean, you still have the, you still have what you would normally have here. You've got a dash, you know, a little glove, uh, a big glove box. It's still got a uh, USB and a light in there, so you can keep all your stuff, your cell phone, and keep it out of the elements. Yeah. The other thing is, this boat's got a, a kick up here. Yep. It lets you stand. It also folds down so you can sit down there, have a full seat facing forward. Yeah. Which is, uh, you know, nice. Mastercraft's got two boats with this, um, but this one comes with it in every single model. Also, an option that this boat doesn't have but is available, you can get a wet bar with a fridge that sits right here. We thought it was a little bit excessive for the boat <laughs> show, but, um, you know, it's always awesome to be able to have, if you've got a boat this big, you're going to be out all day, you can have a full wet bar. Uh, it's got an onboard water system. And a, and a small fridge there. You can keep all your beverages oh, nice. cold. Nice. Um, this boat's got the new dash in it um, with optional navigation. Uh, pretty much anything you'd ever want. Cruise control. Um, you run all of your accessories through there. And uh, you can put charts in it, uh, your gauges. You can also play videos through it. It's pretty, uh, pretty rad. Nice. You know, this by far, because it's the flagship model, um, you know, the fit and finish, the trim, it's incredible. We've got, you know, nice uh, billet accessories along the sides there. Uh, the speaker grills are all billet aluminum. Mm -hmm. You know, really, really nice fit and finish. Everything's made out of billet aluminum. You don't see any plastic parts. There's nothing that's going to rattle or shake or decay over time with yeah. any sun. Um, they've done such a nice job trimming this boat out. Uh, it's definitely, you know, worthy of being a flagship boat. Sure looks it. Okay, let's move along. What else sure. do we got for 2013? So, the next thing for 2013 is the uh, X10. X10. Okay, Jay, the X10. So this is the all new for 2013. It's an X10. It's the little brother of the X30 that we uh, went through last year. Yeah. So, you know, the same great wakes, uh, a really good, nice 21 foot boat um, with some of the same great uh, accessories and options that you see in the X30. Just scale down a little bit. Um, you know, nice big compartments. All of them have gas assist shocks, so you're not throwing seats anywhere in the boat. Mm -hmm. um, this one's also got an optional reversible seat here. So you've got it facing forward right now. Flips up and around and locks in there so you can sit backwards, watch all the action. Yeah. Or you can lay it out. Turn the whole back of the boat into a bed. It's got a filler cushion there, so you turn the whole boat into a big sun deck. Nice. It's pretty awesome. Absolutely. You're sitting backwards, it reveals four cup holders. 
So you'll never have a place where your drink's gonna spill. This boat's also got the all new dash in it. Yep. Um, all right on. Do seven we have power? inch. I think we've got power. Oh. Now we got power. Yeah, so we got the all new touch screen, seven inch, everything's touch. So um, it's got gesturing, you can scroll in between different screens, your video screen, your sat nav, cruise control, and there's your, your full function screen. Yep. Everything's touched. New for this year, they've got a system called Auto Launch. What it does is it utilizes the wake tabs um, along with the throttle control. Yep. So as you're planing out, it controls the tabs, puts them down. Uh, once you get up to speed, it brings them up automatically. You know, it seems like something really simple and easy, but it saves you a ton of money on fuel because it's using those trim tabs to change the shape of the hull uh, and maximize the efficiency of getting up on plane. Normally you use a lot less throttle. You can get up on plane just on a snap. It works great. Simple, it's one touch operation yep. and it figures itself out. Everything now for 2013 is GPS controlled, so all of the speed is satellite based, dead accurate. Um, it's a just simple, nice, easy to use system. And you know, everything's touch and scroll just like your, your smartphone. Yeah. You know, along with that we still have our sort of fixed analog gauges, tried and true. They just let you, you know, see your everything at a glance. And then the touchscreen lets you run all the all the toys and gives you all the extra information. A little bit of both worlds. Looks nice. Absolutely. Yeah. Alrighty. Okay. Jay, we got one more. One more. The next one's the big dog. Oh, the big dog. <laughs> well, Jay, any boat that starts with the letter X is definitely worth getting into. Absolutely. This is the 2013 X Star. This is the boat that you've seen pulling the Pro Tour. It's the ultimate wakeboard boat. Uh, and this one, we've spared no expense. It's got, you know, everything going on. It's got the Pro Tour ballast. Uh, this one, we're lucky enough to have the all-new 520 horsepower, naturally aspirated Ilmore engine. Um, the beautiful thing about this engine, you're getting those 520 horsepower. All of our competitors are having to run superchargers to get this kind of power. We're doing it with just, you know, engineering. The nice thing about it, you can run regular gas and you're seeing up to 30% fuel savings against a competitor. So, you know, we've got all that power, but we're still, you know, not working the engine as hard. We're able to run regular gas. It's great for the pocketbook. Jesus Christ, you got to salute that thing. Absolutely. My God. So this one, we got with the nice Pro Tour orange interior. One of the great things about this boat is we don't order two of the same. So, well, let this, me get in here. This is definitely worth getting into. <laughs> This one's got all the orange interior, but each one of these panels can be colored something different. So everybody can, you know, you can custom order your boat, fine tune it. Yeah. Nobody gets two boats the same. This one again has that awesome reversible seat so you can watch all the action behind the boat. Very nice. Huge storage, built-in cooler. There it is. Also got a built-in trash container. Make sure that all those empties go in there. Pop cans. Pop cans, absolutely. Um, the seating in this boat is kind of a nice wrap around, but also your walkover converts into another observer seat. And then Mastercraft with oh. the piece de resistance. Mastercraft with their all new dash in this boat. So, like the other one, it's got the touch screens, um, but this one, Mastercraft likes to call it the glass dash because there's no buttons and the most trick element your oh main screen God. comes up on an actuator absolutely you know the great thing about it is you have so much options because all of the dash all the elements run through touchscreen and through uh, you can customize the dashes to tell you different things at different times and um, you've got you know more than one way to get to where you want to be for wakeboarding. So you can select your cruise up at the top dash on the touch screen right here. Uh, also through your hard switches on the sides here. The boats, the way they work is really trick. You've got an ignition key yeah. and then a start and stop button. I'm not going to start it here because obviously we're not in the water like we want to be. Just a quick one maybe? <laughs> no, no way. <laughs>
But yeah, that's the 2012 X, the 2013 X Star. Yeah. Um, you know, so far more new tricks have been landed behind the 2013 X Star than any other boat out there since it's come out. They've landed something like. 11 or 12 new tricks that no one's ever done wake to wake and it's all because of the awesome engineering of this boat. The other thing that we're really lucky to have this year is Super Trick Tower. It's nice and easy to come down. Just one, two latches. Make sure your board racks are in. Board racks come in. These gas assist shocks are going to help me take the weight off. It just comes down one hand. From there we can lock it, trailer with it down so you're not going to get the bugs on there, have it down in your boathouse. It's nice and sturdy even when it's in the down position. Yeah. Go back up, pull the tabs out, lift it back up, lock them back in, and you're ready to ride. Ready to rock, yeah, absolutely. Very nice. So yeah, that's the 2013 X-Star, the ultimate wakeboarding machine. Jay, thank you very much for my pleasure. Boats. Absolutely. It's great to see you guys. What a boat, it's man. It's crazy, eh? Hey? It takes a little bit to boot up. How cool is that? So cool. That is so cool. You sit there and do that all day long. All day long. <laughs> Might as well just bring it down. Okay. The other cool thing with it is you can run it up and down even after the boat started. Mm -hmm. So if you're, you know, you find that your view is impaired. You can use this switch and bring it up and down. Manually, can I just bring it up. And then and you get all the extra information that was on there. It's not as big, but you have it on these two gauges. Yeah, yeah. So you can have better visibility. You can also, I like to run it like down a little bit, like you can stop it in the halfway points. Uh huh. So you, you know, you can essentially customize how you like to see the boat. It's yeah. pretty, it's pretty sweet. Have you driven this boat? Absolutely. And? You know, a lot of times with the big wakeboard boats, it's difficult you know you're pushing a lot of weight around one of the nice things about this boat you know especially with this engine you got tons and tons of power it gets up planes out no problem um, but also it's available with hydraulic steering mm -hmm. which when we order the big power we normally order the hydraulic steering um, and it just handles like a little sport boat um, it's got all that weight in it but you can still just turn it around it turns on itself um, you know I've had the ability to drive a lot of wakeboard boats and even fully loaded with like 2,600 pounds, just turn it on itself, get it back up on plane. It's just unbelievable how agile it is yeah. for such a big boat. Wow. This must be fun to drive though, man. It's a ton of fun. Yeah, no <laughs> kidding. No kidding. Good evening. And that engine just screams. It's, it's a lot of fun. It sounds like an airplane engine. Not loud, but just because it revs so high to get the horsepower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really cool. We would ask that you